are there some significantly wrong decisions that Baiju's made? As uh, we've pointed out that Baiju's decided to acquire White Hat in 2020, then Akash and Topper in 2021, and this, even though it was making losses. So one, serious wrong decisions that were made, according to you, what do you think on that? On the other side, um, as we've mentioned, that this is India's, one of India's most valued startups. So does that raise a question over the startup industry at large, and will it make it difficult for other startups to also get funds? Sure. So, uh, you know, focusing on the first question of, mm. of whether the acquisition decisions were wrong, uh, I think, uh, you know, at some, uh, you know, to some extent, at least what might have, uh, you know, what might have uh, been a function of the decision to acquire mm. would have been the metrics used for valuation, which, if I'm not mistaken, at that time was was very top. Uh, you know, top line focused uh, metrics for valuation. So, uh, you know, if you if you look around, we see a lot of instances of startups acquiring revenue uh, without possibly necessarily not without without validating the targets business model and targets unit economics. So, uh, you know, you can't put it past any of the startups and and by juice naturally that they may have also they might have also done that. Uh, so was that a wrong decision? Uh, f so at that time, it certainly did not look like a wrong decision. Mm. Now, as Ganesh pointed out, uh, multiple things have 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 happened. Multiple macro uh, factors have 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 come to come to bear uh, in the last twelve to eighteen months. The biggest being the world uh, economy shrinking uh, when the central bank started. Hmm. Uh, backing down on inflation. So is, is most of uh, are most of the troubles because the pandemic happened and then the world economy shrank, of course, or is it something particularly wrong with Baiju's? So I, I think it is more to do with uh, macroeconomics. If you look at the entire cycle, because it was the pandemic that uh, drove up the demand for uh, right. drove up the demand in an unnatural cycle or through an un unnatural cycle which was relied upon by uh, sources of capital to uh, put in a lot of, uh, you know, to 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 uh, deploy a lot of capital into hmm. many businesses. And when that demand pulled back, uh, you know, those, the, the, you know, the, the, the revenue stand, the, there were questions raised on the models. Hmm. And on top of it, the market shrunk, the liquidity gotten sucked, you know, the liquidity got sucked out of the market which uh which which made ongoing funding for for growth and for sustenance all right a, a, a difficult uh, proposition